Good morning. This is Puerto de la Cruz in Tenerife, about 20 miles from the Santa Cruz, the capital. And you can see the nice snowy mountain up here. And I didn't even know that uh, they have the botanic gardens here. So the bus stop just next to the botanic gardens. It's the seaside town. So actually I wanted to go to the seaside to walk around in a town. And uh, here I am just wondering, should I go to the botanic gardens, which I usually like. The weather's quite nice, 10th of February, 2023. So it's gonna be about 17 degrees, but windy at times. So I got my jacket on just in case a lot of people have a proper summer outfit. So, okay, let's check how much are the tickets for the Botanic Gardens. And this is the location for the Laura Park also, which is the most famous zoo here in Tenerife. But like I said yesterday, I don't think I'm really going there. Maybe I'm wandering around, we'll see. So we'll see how much are the tickets. Wow, tickets only three euros. That's very good. Definitely gonna go in. That's a big one. Quite a few people around here. Yeah, so the ticket was exactly three euros. The past cost me from my apartment, which is about, I don't know, 25 minute ride. It was only, well, not only, but four, four euros and 10 cents. And they were no stops even, so it was just my stop there when I went on. And the next stop was pretty much here where I am now so that was, it's like a going with a taxi pretty good stuff oh nice and green and sunny actually the weather cast was showing that it's gonna be like nearly 80% chance of rain but of course it could come easily jungle here that is nice bird good it's not too big the botanic gardens it's just enough size to walk around half an hour here see some very interesting trees I've never seen in my life very exotic Oh, that's good. Oh, that's huge. Probably the most interesting one. It's gonna come up here. Not this one, but that one over here. That is fucking wild. Wow. Huge. I think I'm the youngest person in the park here. It's a lot of German tourists. Got myself a magnet again, 225 euros. This is how it is. Got uh, written the town names which I'm visiting, so that's good enough for me. Now I'm going to the city center. 
check out the port area. The Laura Park bus zoo. So you got a map of Tenerife. Santa Cruz, the capital, is over there. And I am over here, Puerto de la Cruz. Only about 30,000 people live here. But, well, officially, I don't know. In summertime, it could be fucking few hundred thousand, I believe. And you got the national park, the highest peak. That's a very nice map. Tiny church over here. Is that from 16th century? The smallest one I've seen, maybe. Right, nearly on the seaside now. Let's check out what's going on there. around there I want to go now it's not like a proper beach over there there's like a black black ones around here and a proper sandy one I've checked out the other side Surrounded by uh, very big mountains, actually. Hills, so it's very beautiful location. Love hotels down here. down lot of stairs wouldn't like to go up actually hopefully I don't have to go somewhere there I was before oh, from down is even better views I think yeah it looks like nearly down I'm trying out the uh, Americano in Burger King usually I'm going to McDonald's or cafes, whatever, but now first time in my life I'm gonna have a coffee from Burger King and see how it will taste like 146 was. This is the Burger King coffee. Good amount, haven't tried it yet, very hot, seems to be strong. I'm going to the toilet now, that's the third time I'm going to the toilet already. Uh, the coffee isn't some, uh, well, little coffee in the morning and the tea. So the Burger King coffee is very good, I have to say. Is it better than McDonald's coffee? Uh, it's very hard to tell. I used to have a lot of cappuccinos, but now they are not you know, strong enough for me actually, so I want only some Americanos. There's a viewpoint over there where I was, somewhere, somewhere there. In the morning, the coffee I had in an apartment was the some Nespresso with the milk. So that wasn't strong enough, that's why I'm having my other one. Now, let's go to the beach side. There's Parrot over here. Seen it like three times already. Nice cliffs here. Mm 
that is the viewpoint that was there, so it's a long way down. This is a nice pool area next to the beach, beach where you can stay. It's good to have that one here because there's no proper sandy beach, just a black shit, so that's very nice. <laughs> The amount of Germans here, this is just unbelievable, I have to say. So far, this is like, I don't know, definitely not in Spain. if you want to stay in one of these thingies over here then you have five five fifty for uh, entrance and then you have a chair for two so by eight euros ten to six and this one is not for swimming so the other one was for swimming maybe it is more expensive but it's very beautiful. If you're gonna stay there all day and it's nice. So now we don't know, the clouds are there. Now it's very hot, so I had to take off my things here. But I still have a jeans on, I can't take them off, otherwise I get fucking arrested. This Friday. Yeah. I found a super Dino here in Tenerife. Spar. Ah, oh, McDonald's is here. I just finished my coffee. Super Dino. Didn't see it yesterday. I thought maybe in Tenerife they don't have it, but they do have. Mercadona is the other big one, which uh, is not my favorite because the beer choice is rather fucking shite there. There's a choo-choo drain here. <laughs> Casino. Quite impressive town, I have to say. another church here these rocks are full of crabs here you can see interesting Happy camper. Here we have the viewpoint of Puerto de la Cruz. That is pretty good, I have to say.
very nice seaside location. There's a big fountain going on in the end there. I believe this is even more beautiful than the capital, Santa Cruz. We have the ship museum. That is for free. Ark. <laughs> I already spotted the Titanic there. See the Titanic. There it is. The main one. Oh, that's a big one. There's another Titanic queue. But that one is definitely uh, something out of this world. the craps. Hello. Hello. Well done. All right, there we go. Oh, nice park here. The law of wooden balconies over there. <coughs> very good, let's sit down for uh, two minutes. Oh, very good. We have one of the beaches just next to the Laura Park, the big zoo. Yeah, nice waves. Another nice view here for the beach. Right, I'm gonna check out the entrance of the Laura Park now. We'll see what's going on there. entrance of the Laura Park. This is a proper Chinese temple. That alone is already very fucking interesting even if I don't go out. I think the ticket was like 82 fucking hell, 28 euros. Yeah. Laura Park, 50th anniversary animal embassy. 
elephants here already, you can see. Let's see what's happening. <laughs> Probably a lot of people there. For sure there's a lot of people around. The child ticket is 28, the adult is 40 euros. Time is already exceeding all the limits. Holy shit, what the fuck is this? Back in Santa Cruz, the capital of Tenerife, after one hour from the Puerto de la Cruz. Ticket cost me five euros twenty five cents. That is an interesting sight here. The weather is different here. Good. I'm fucking have my chains on. I'm very happy because in Puerto de la Cruz I was like, oh my god, fucking hell, why did I put my chains on? But now it was raining before around here, so it's about 40 kilometers from the place I came. So I'm gonna explore the capital a little bit. Busy times, people finishing work. I think that's fucking horrible. All right, let's go there. It's the auditorium of Tenerife. It's very big. You can see the town. The shopping center went there, bought some beers yesterday. These are the highest buildings, the two of them in town, I think. And the bus station is just next to the shopping center very good nice mountain views here this is the one from the other side It's a pretty big thingy. I installed my microphone now because it got very windy here. I want to see is there any difference. I forgot to use it before, I had it in my pocket. And the upper part there is a town also. I love these mountains, they're very nice. Okay, I'm gonna go now to the city center. Get away from the seaside a little bit. There's a little action park next to the city center. Ah, Tom and Jerry ride. Very good. There's another ride over here, the Dragon, the most fucking famous, who doesn't know the fucking Dragon? God damn it, that's good. And there we got the master of disaster, the Hulk, and the octopus. Ah, saucy. Seem to find a nice street here. Maybe the main shopping street. It's a nice drawing from the jazz player. Found some architecture here. In Santa Cruz. That one also have a little Hungarian feeling now. What we got here now. That's pretty good. Let's do 
supermarket. That is the first time in a fucking super core. So bought some orange juice. That's a pretty big bottle. 330, only one euro and 15 cents. Should be all natural. So I'm fucking smoke fucking weed here. That guy there, I think. Seem to be a bit fucking all over the place. <laughs> Just walking around, I found a park randomly. With a fountain. Just enjoying my orange juice. So I want. Mm. Ah, fucking hell, that's good. Oh. Didn't eat for like seven hours. Then still feel alright. I mean, it's nice when the weather is good. It doesn't have to fucking eat all the time. I had a great breakfast. I had three scrambled eggs. I had a blueberries, raspberries, green tea, coffee, half a grapefruit, and a half avocado. So the fucking proper one. Not full English shit. Which I love. <laughs> Sometimes. Oh yeah. I'll sit down here for one minute. Enjoy my fucking orange juice. Whoa. Very good. That's better. There we go. What is that? Very interesting. Sorry. Looks like Iron Maiden. Got palms here. Beautiful. Let's have one here. Oh. oh! Kicks ass. I had one beer about three hours ago. A very light one before the zoo. Oh. Now it's a bit cloudy, although it's not cold. But, you know, weather is only good for the orange juice. So this one is definitely the uh, most beautiful building I've seen today. Very beautiful architecture here. Otherwise, I forget I'm in Spain. But Santa Cruz seemed to be okay, I mean. It's more quiet than Las Palmas in Gran Canaria. Was it smaller? A couple of nice ones here next to the little park. Very nice. That is the museum. Good one. Not nice trees here. Oh, these are these are proper nice ones. Evening's gonna be busy, I believe, in a couple of hours. That is a wild one here. Wow, look at this. Cool. One more, it's next to the other one. Yeah, keep them coming. A nice tree. Ah, there's some more nice buildings over there. Can't complain about the city center at all. It's just getting better. This is the start of the long shopping street. Now I am back where I actually wanted to go first place. That's the interesting looking building for oh, that one as well. That is a very interesting one. Donalds. 
can't have too many coffees, I'll get fucking all shaky. No good. I think that building over there is just some bunch of components there. Ah, they're ready for the Tina Turner concert. Oh, that's good, yeah. That is very nice. United Scholars of Benetton is written up there. Be nice to get in there. So what time is the Tina Turner? Simply the best. Three people waiting. Robert Sink. I didn't see this one. That is very interesting. Santander, the Spanish bank. That is very nice. Get closer. Right, let's see where is the entrance. You never know, maybe it's open. There's the old town over there. So I saw yesterday, but I'm gonna walk through it still. I could go in a little bit, some companies over here. But now I don't see the stairs going. Oh, there is a lift over there. Let's have a look. Look up there. Oh yeah, that's pretty good. Oh yeah, the staircase is over here. Let's try that one and lift. Yeah, seems to be working very good. Zoning company on the fourth floor, so I'm going the on the third floor now. Oh, this one's also open. Just like that. Maybe from the other side. So this one is another lift here. Let's try that one. Still a few companies over here. Okay. No, I couldn't go. There's no there's no way. No luck here. But at least I could see a couple of floors. How does it look like? So that was this one over there. See how many floor he has. Floors. Maybe there's another entrance somewhere. The other side. Because that one or lift has only three floors and it has three floors there, so, so but never mind. It started raining like shit, I had to wait near the sky. <laughs> I had to wait 5 minutes at the station So I have like 13 minutes walk home The fucking traffic is so bad it's stuck I'm happy I didn't fucking rent a car There's no need But very good Got myself some beers And my day was done anyway so Just in right time it started to rain That's perfect Can't believe <laughs> In the afternoon was such a beach weather. Well, of course it's a 40 kilometers away, but I don't think there will be any fucking beach weather in the other town I went before. Yeah, nothing's moving on the other side. All right, let's go back to the apartment. Got back home. Very nice. Didn't get too wet, although the hair was very wet. So I got some beers here. Try tomorrow or today because I still have some in the fridge. And now I'm gonna cook something. 20 kilometers walked, so that is enough. All right, guys, that is it with day two in Tenerife. See you later, guys.